You hate to think that your Shih Tzu isn't happy with you or doesn't really like you, but it can happen. And they do give you signs that something is off. If you pick up on several of these signs, you might want to consider changing your behavior instead of assuming it is your dog's behavior that needs to change. That's why today's episode, we will share 15 signs your Shih Tzu may secretly hate you but you don't know about. Number 1. They are showing you their teeth. When a Shih Tzu is showing you their teeth, it is a sign of aggression. They are angry or upset. They might feel they are protecting their territory. Or they may feel threatened by you or someone else in your household. Don't ignore this body language. Your Shih Tzu is telling you there is something wrong. You need to listen to them. And while a Shih Tzu might not be able to do much damage with their little teeth, you still don't want them acting in a way that they feel they need to protect themselves. Back off for the moment, but then investigate further. If this is new behavior for them, make sure your furry friend isn't sick or injured or has some medical issue that can cause this type of issue as well. Number 2. They're using your house as a toilet. Is your Shih Tzu suddenly treating your whole house like his personal powder room? It could be a sign that he's not so happy about your behavior. If your pet is pooping wherever he pleases, it may be a sign that you're not walking them or changing their litter box frequently enough. It could also be a sign your pet is fearful, so consider addressing your own behaviors, like yelling or slamming doors, that could make them scare. Number 3. They ignore your commands. If your Shih Tzu seems to be giving you the cold shoulder and ignoring your commands all of a sudden, it's a good sign they're not happy with you. Shih Tzu in particular may ignore commands when they're feeling upset. Number 4. They won't play with you. Shih Tzus love to play. They love to chase balls and play with their toys, and they want you to get involved. Playing by themselves is great, but add in their owner, and they are in hog heaven. If your Shih Tzu's playing habits have changed or they have stopped playing altogether, it is a sign they are unhappy, depressed, or just not that into you. The first thing you should do is make sure they aren't sick or injured. A quick trip to the vet will help with this. Number 5. They groom themselves too much. It is normal for your dog to scratch or lick themselves once in a while. They get an itch just like we do, but it if is constant, then something else is wrong. They could have fleas, and if they have a flea allergy, they will lick and bit themselves to the point of pulling out their hair. If it isn't fleas or some skin condition, then it could be stress. An unhappy Shih Tzu will try to make themselves feel better by licking themselves. This can be their attempt to deal with anxiety or stress. Once again, a trip to the vet wouldn't hurt. Number 6. They aren't eating. If you've had a Shih Tzu for any length of time, then you know they love their food and especially treats. That's pretty par for the course. So if all of a sudden, they aren't eating something is up. They could be sick or stressed or upset about something going on with you or within the house. A missed meal or two isn't a big deal, but beyond that, or for a few days, it shouldn't be ignored. Number 7. They make direct eye contact a lot. There is nothing better than when your pup lays their head in your lap and looks lovingly into your eyes. It can show just how much they love and trust you. However, if your Shih Tzu was looking you directly in your eyes, without breaking eye contact a lot, this could spell trouble. One way dogs show dominance is to stare down their opponent. If you see two dogs growling at each other or acting aggressively, this is one thing they do to let the other dog know that they are the top dog. So, if it isn't the loving gaze and just plain naked aggression, that's a bad sign. Number 8. They growl at you. There is a big difference between barking and growling when it comes to dogs. A barking dog just might be excited to see you or wants your attention or to even play. A growling dog is not a happy dog. They are warning you to stay away. If you don't pay attention, you could get bit. And while a Shih Tzu isn't going to do a lot of damage, you still don't want yours to bite you or someone else or a child. This type of behavior you can't ignore. If you have been abusing your dog, then you can expect this behavior from them. If you haven't been, and there is no one in your household that is stressing them out or being abusive, then they could be injured. Number 9. 
He refuses to wag his tail when he sees you. A telltale sign that a Shih Tzu is excited to see you is wagging his tail. He will hold the tail higher than its natural position and wag it furiously. This behavior is evident when playing with other dogs. Sometimes, he adopts a playful stance with the bottom elevated, inviting you to play with him. However, if he dislikes you, he may tuck away his tail. It could be he feels scared, nervous, or extremely submissive around you. Some dogs tuck the tail against their belly or between the rear legs, especially when feeling defensive. Number 10. They try to bite you. Even worse than growling is biting. However, one might lead to the other. If your dog is growling at you and you try to pick them up or touch them, there is a good bet they will bite you. Anytime your Shih Tzu feels threatened, they may resort to biting. Number 11. They avoid you. It's hard to feel like your Shih Tzu suddenly doesn't enjoy your company anymore, but it's important to listen up if that's how they're acting. Pets, particularly those who are anxious, depressed, or have been abused, will regularly ignore their human caretakers. Fortunately, using a calm voice, rewarding good behavior, never hitting or yelling at your pet, and demonstrating plenty of patience can help them feel more secure in no time. Number 12. They become destructive. There are a lot of reasons why your Shih Tzu might be destructive. From separation anxiety, which Shih Tzus tend to suffer from a lot, to fear or not getting enough attention. They aren't destroying your home just for the heck of it or to give you the finger. There is something wrong, and it is their way of showing you that. Maybe they need more attention when you are home. Or perhaps they need a dog walker to come by in the middle of the day so they can get some exercise. Number 13. He doesn't want to be touched. Most dogs are affectionate and love being touched and cuddled. If that's not the case with yours, it could be he dislikes you. This was the case with my pup, as he often resisted any affectionate gesture from me. He no longer leaned in to cuddle me back, rather he pulled away, looking for a way to escape. It could be yours isn't accustomed to touch, but if he suddenly develops resistance, it's a sign he doesn't like you. Number 14. They aren't sleeping. Shih Tzus do like their naps, so if they aren't sleeping there, is a reason for it. My Shih Tzu, who was a rescue, has always been a little skittish. She was abused as a puppy but now that she is getting older, she is almost 14 years old, and her skittishness has gotten much worse. She has a hard time laying down at night and getting any rest. Shih Tzu will just walk the house back and forth over and over. There is nothing physically wrong with her, but she is simply stressed out. The vet and I are working on it. So there are reasons why your Shih Tzu might stop sleeping, but none of them point to things being normal. Number 15. They don't want you to pet them. Most dogs, including Shih Tzus, want to be petted. Some just want it from time to time, while others demand attention all the time. Either way, this is normal behavior for your pet. If all of a sudden your dog no longer wants to be pet, then something is going on. They are either upset with you or they are not feeling well. 